Welcome to Shorty Supercoach, and uh, it's a disappointing weekend. It's a very disappointing weekend. Uh, couldn't even tell you how I went in Classic, but we're in the draft grand final, and yeah, I haven't even checked the scores since about 4 o'clock today, but we were well and truly cooked. So let's go into that now. I've already had my rage. I am. Um, you know, I cracked it this afternoon. I was very disappointed. Really thought I could win. But we've since driven down to the coast. Had a nice chocolate. Eaten some muffins. And uh, we've calmed down a little bit. But there were certain stages this weekend where I'll tell you what, it was all consuming. It was all consuming. I was just, you know, so hell bent on winning this thing. And uh, look. Score 1909 is wildly impressive. I mean, my score of 1752 is pretty good. It's pretty good. Um, you know, a really good score is in the 1800s. So to score 1909, you just got to tip your hat and say, well done, really. Um, I yeah, it was, as you guys would have seen, I was doing pretty well just to even make the grand final. You know, had to win my way into the four in the last week. Knockout, knockout, bang, bang, bang. We got our way through. Bit lucky last week, but no, nah, just too good. Too good there. Um, and again, we're just sort of plateauing on the classic 2,489. We had a nice captaincy with Bonds and Pally. Um, but. You know, Kerno's 33 certainly hurts you. We're able to loophole Rao, which is always handy. And even keeping McCurtry on field instead of Dawson was a slight edge. So, um, good to see Luke Ryan back in some decent form. Nick Martin, good. Houston, good. Tom Stewart, really good. Dacos, you know, all tunning up. Everyone in the back line tunning up. We love to see that. Bonson Pally, huge. Butters, fantastic. Merritt, really, really good. Um... You know, Tom Green was really good as well. Rosie turned up, Walsh turned up, McKercher and Rao. So there's not too much going wrong. Gorn turned up in what was a terrible day for the Swans. Grundy still delivered 89. Flanders 91. Zorko 96. 94 for more. Heaney's out of touch. But such is the closeness of this season and, and how similar most sides are to have Luke Jackson and Kerno not even score 100 between them. That absolutely kills you. You know, it's, it's a pretty good... we got 22 blokes scoring, and 20 of them scored pretty well, you know. But um, Heaney was a bit down, but otherwise, you know, it was really just these last three spots in there. But, you know, we get ranking back. Um, I'm not sure how many leagues I would have won. Probably not many. Um, okay, we got a few. we got a few. So what are we... We're in the, uh, the minor leagues here, I would imagine, yes. Yes, we're just in the minor leagues there, but we got a W, so... Oh, an eight-point win over Kov. We just got in big from McCuzzer there, and he did signal this one in the live, so he got me done 10 points to Rhyme Dusty. That hurts. Good win there. Tight win there over Nick as well. Big one there, 26,000. We love that. Um... Yeah, some big results, obviously. Some big scores. So a bit of a mixed bag, really. Oh, one point lost. Oh, and this... I think I saw his message come through. Fuck. What a killer. What a killer. Well done, mate. Well done. Look, honestly, it, we got a few weeks left now, and, you know, it's really just about trying to have that one big week where you can just, you know, rejoice in a top 200 weekly finish or something like that. It really, again, hasn't been the year I had wanted. It was only three or four weeks ago that I thought it was going to be quality. You know, these um, longer-term holds haven't really paid off, and we're running out of weeks for them to pay off. I'm out of my draft. I lose that. I'm, I'm out of my cash leagues. You know, there's a, still a couple of leagues that I can win and, and whatnot. But, yeah, probably some of the main goals I was hoping to get for the year just uh, haven't transpired the way I would have liked. So, 
you know, it's disappointing. Sometimes you you sit around and you're like, gee, sometimes I feel like Super Coach just gives us more frustrating moments than good ones. But yeah, I, I just I can't express my hate towards the cookie cutter system that we have. I did a video at the end of last year about how we could make it more engaging, more unique. Um, you know, it just yeah, there's such a glut of similarities with the bulk of the competition. You know, I'm always tempted about sh really shaking it up and just having more of a point of different side or going a bit against the grain. Um, and to be honest, maybe next year I will because let's face it, I've gone with, you know, at the start of the year I was a couple of different ones. I always like to have a little bit of point of difference, but more or less a very, um, you know, similar structure to most. And, you know, I, I haven't finished top 1,000 for a very, very long time. Well, top 2,000 was my best, but... Um, Maybe next year's the time we, we just shake it up and, and pick players that uh, I've got real faith in, even if they're mid-prices, but we'll see. That's one for next year. You know, it's, uh, it's a good score. It is a good score, but, you know, it's very competitive at the moment. And, you know, if if Kerno and Jackson had have just delivered 80s, you know, we, we probably would have made a big difference. You know, we would have been pretty much would have got 2600 you know if they could have just delivered so you know that's the difference of not having a cold well or that type of thing and um yeah ranking coming back will help but yeah we'll uh we'll wait and see so i'll be live on wednesday um the usual time slot about quarter to eight on youtube about seven o'clock on tiktok so yeah if you want to come talk some trash any questions i know there's not as much to talk about at the moment but always happy to have a chat about footy or whatever, to be honest. So, um, yeah, I'll leave it at that. I hope you had a good weekend, and uh, yeah, we'll uh, we'll see how we go. We'll try and sleep this disappointment off. I'll talk to you later. Cheers.